Hi, my name's Stefan. Today I'm going to be speaking on how to find the intercepts of a piecewise function. Now, let's uh, say for example we have the piecewise function y equals x squared when x is less than 0 and y equals x when x is greater than or equal to 0. Now when we plot that, it looks like this. Now we have the two pieces of the function. Now basically all we want to do is find the intercepts okay when y equals 0 in the first function x squared okay so x is equal to 0 and when y equals 0 for the next function x is equivalent to 0 these are the two functions here so in this uh, function here since uh, x is equivalent to uh, 0 when y equals 0, we can see that there's only one x-intercept and y-intercept is at this point here. And it's only for this function here. x is never equivalent to 0 over here for the first piece because x is always less than or equal to 0. So to solve this, it's y-intercept is 0, and x-intercept is also at 0. This is how you find the y-intercept and x-intercept of a piecewise function.